welcome back to my channel. I'm Lena, this is Lena's Bookshelf. So, I am on my way to see Jacqueline. We are going to go hang out in a town that's about halfway between both of us. And we are going to go to some little free libraries. We're gonna get some lunch. We're gonna drink some wine afterwards. It's gonna be so fun. So it's gonna take me about an hour to get there. Um, I've been so excited all morning. I literally have been up since, like I woke up before my alarm. I set my alarm for 6.30, but I was up at 5.45 <laughs> um, cause I was so excited. So it's gonna take me about an hour to get there. So I'm very excited. I'm gonna get to driving and I will update you when I am with Jackie. And then one that was like a cute little one um, that fit like maybe 20 books. And so yeah, they were just really cute. Um, and then there was a couple of others that we knew were like by school, so we didn't really go there because we figured it would just be kid books. And then the one in the popcorn place was just kid books. But yeah, so like really cute, really creative stuff. And so now we are headed to the winery. We're headed to uh, a winery for food and wine flights. So that will be fun. Uh, it should take me about 20 minutes to get there. after dinner with vanilla ice cream. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're doing this all wrong. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I do think the hops is, is better than the Joy White, in my opinion, actually. Mm. Like, trying them side by side, like white versus mm. white. Okay, I am back home. I had so much fun today with Jackie. Oh my gosh, we had so much fun. Um, but she gave me 
this box and she told me she's like don't open it here in front of me wait until you get home so and she said I could open it on camera um she said and it was in her car so she said part of it might melt but um so I wanted to open it with you all and I'll open it on here and then I'll um Marco Polo her too Ooh. okay here we go oh my goodness oh. Jackie. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, Ooh, okay. This is what she was telling me. Probably melted. Oh my gosh. I love these. Oh my gosh. How did she know these are my favorite? I absolutely love these sea salt, sea salt caramels. And I am totally fine with the fact that they're melted because like she was saying, I'm just going to wait until it hardens and then like chop them up and eat them like that. So very excited for when those, um, or maybe I'll just like eat them with a spoon when they're Oh my gosh, it totally is the type of tumbler that I like. Oh. oh my gosh. It's like such a great color too. Oh my gosh, she knows me so well. But it probably keeps stuff like so cold. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. This is exactly what I like to drink out of. I give her a tumbler too, which is funny. And it has, ooh, and it has another type of lid so you can use both. And oh my gosh, oh, I've seen this. Oh my gosh. That's what she was asking. Oh my God, Jackie. So she asked me, she was like, what are like your 10 favorite books? And I was like, 10 favorite books? Like that's hard. And I didn't even ask her why. I was just like, oh yeah, here's a list of my 10 favorite books. And she put them all on a mug we have escape the giver 19 minutes small great things oh my gosh the dream daughter the time traveler's wife oh my gosh i love it i'm so excited david's tea Ooh, sweet potato pie she asked me what type of tea i like too see i should have known what she was up to when she asked me all these questions oh my gosh that smells so good it smells so good and then I'm guessing this is a book. Oh my gosh, it's two books. <gasps> Mother Noise. Oh, I'm so excited. So this is about addiction. Very excited about that. And then, ooh, we have the island. I'm very excited about this. This has been super, super anticipated by so many people. I'm so excited. And I think Jackie's gonna read this soon, so maybe we can read it together. So excited. I'm hoping that this is exactly what I wanted The Missing by Kirsten Modulin to be. Oh, this is just, this has been such a good day. I'm so happy we did this. She's just so genuine. Like sometimes you watch videos of people and you're like, are they really like that? But like exactly the way Jackie is in her videos, that's exactly the way she is in person, which is really cool. So for the rest of this weekend, um, I think now I'm actually going to be reading after this. Um, so I have Under Her Care by Lucinda Berry to read. And I think tonight um, I'm gonna make some buffalo chicken dip. I'm gonna have a fire in my backyard. And then tomorrow I'm going to go kayaking. So I will take you along with all of my fun summer weekend plans. And I will update you when, I've only read a couple pages of this, so I'm not even ready to say anything about it yet. So I'll read a little bit more and then I'll update you.
morning. Happy Sunday. So I have my coffee here. Um, I made a Stormio Nespresso coffee pod in my adorable little mug from Jackie with all my favorite books. Um, and when I make the Stormio, it's like a darker roast <clears throat> of the Nespresso coffee pods. So um, I have some almond milk, some half and half, and a little bit of vanilla creamer. Um, and that's kind of how I, what I like to do with the uh, darker roast Nespresso pods. So I'm just sitting here drinking my coffee and reading Under Her Care by Lucinda Berry. And so Under Her Care is about a murder. And um, when the murder is discovered, when there, there's a dead body that is discovered, um, there is a boy with autism that was found near the scene um, covered in the victim's blood. So we are following this pediatric psychiatrist who um, treats children with autism spectrum disorder. And so she is helping the police to um, get a statement from this boy with ASD. He does not communicate verbally and um, he has a lot of um, sensory and behavioral supports provided to him by his mother. So um, the psychiatrist definitely has her work cut out for her trying to get a, um, you know, statement, so to speak, um, from the police. Although it's not going to be a statement the way they would expect, I, I, is what I imagine. Um, just because I work with individuals with autism and um, different types of intellectual disabilities. So I am just going to sit here, drink my coffee. Um, I think we have some some fun things planned today, but um, I also need to get um, some packing done. I have to pack for my trip, um, my work trip to Phoenix this week. So I will keep on reading and I will update you when I have something else to update you on. <music> have reached the end of this weekend vlog. It has been a long, busy, fun weekend. Thanks for coming along with me as I hung out with Jackie and all of the other relaxing, summery self-care things I did today. Um, I have finished Under Her Care by Lucinda Berry and it was really good. It was really good. I liked the characters, I liked the reveals, I don't know what I'm going to rate it yet, so stay tuned for my rating, um, maybe I'll link my Goodreads rating below, but yeah, um, I loved everything about this. I love that um, a psychiatrist looked at autism from a different angle. I like that she brings to light um, a lot of different angles behind what somebody who is neurodivergent would go through. Um, I like, you all know, one of my favorite tropes in thrillers is the how far would you go for your family trope. And this did that. Lucinda Berry often does that in her books. Um, she's just so wonderful and so smart. So. Now I've read all of her books and I will be able to do a ranking video of what I think of all of her books. Um, so yeah, so I don't wanna to give too much away because I definitely want to give a more thorough review in that video. Also, it's so late that I can barely put my thoughts together. So thank you so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button. It really helps out my channel and I will see you in my next video.